So here's an update to our progress. We've uh, just completed most of the wet rain catchment system here. We've got 4 inch PVC in the ground just below grade. Going up to our two gutters. We have a gutter on the front side of the house right here and one on the back cover right there. So the, our rain catchment system is basically going to function you know, the rain will come down these four inch pipes down into these joints here into one four inch pipe that goes from right here in the front of the property all the way to the back into that tote back there that's just one of a couple totes that we're planning on having if not more what we've also done is sloped this pipe right here towards the front using this level right here our water level what the boys did were, was make sure that there was about an inch slope between it looks like about 20 feet and again it's coming it's sloping back to this point here and this line also slopes out here to our ditch at the end of this line here we have a clean out so if any sediment or any kind of dirt is in the line it should come to this lowest point yeah and we can drain it out at that point so here's a little more detail of our connection to our pipes here those are our custom gutters right there we've cut a hole in it and we have a little screen at the top of that PVC 90 degree bend we have two of those so we'll walk down this way and show you the water will go uphill basically this, essentially water is going to try to find the, a level point and our our level point is over there by the the tote that's the the lowest level point so this is actually higher what ends up happening is once the water reaches say this height right here it actually spills over into the tank over there in addition to that we have our water supply line paralleling it three-quarter inch PVC and it, uh, later date we plan on putting a 12 volt pump on there connected to these water storage tanks you can see our stands there for those totes to be off the ground they're concreted in and you can see how the water is going to come into here we've made it so that these pipes are removable so we can service it and we're planning on having a four inch to six inch boot here to completely seal it off to the elements and this first tank we're envisioning will be another place where sediment would settle and once it's full we're thinking that we'll have a pipe that comes off of the top right here and goes to our next tanks that way even every successive tank after that will be cleaner water so there's a view from the back side of what we've been working on these past couple days. Just in time for rain in the next day or two. So hopefully it will work as planned.